my predictions came to actually. You know, previously I was telling my girls that Tega was going to go back home. And guess what? She's back home. Back to the street. On the street. The street I was trying to talk about uh, is her husband's house. Hey, hey. You know, while she was still in the house, she was still philandering all about, you know, thinking she still has grant. But in the course of that, the other one was, you know, trying to uh, converse for her, saying uh, he knew he was the one who broke the bond, he was the one who cheated, you know, he was trying to make excuses for her. And that does not, you know, at least give her the audacity to do what she did on her. Imagine it went by millions of people were busy, were busy watching what uh, she was caught doing with Boma on that duty. But she understood that she was not emotional about it. We all knew that she was not emotional about it. She was not saying she was ready. Anything that comes out of it, she's ready to face the music. But reverse was the case. So while she was being evicted, my sister boldly said she has missed her husband. She has missed her home. Are you sure there's not there's no sort of confusion here? Will I say she's confused or not? Because at one point she was saying she does not care her husband does this, her husband she does not care maybe her husband still wants her back or not because she was enjoying the pleasure. She was enjoying the charisma, the energy being put in by Puma. Mm, it's not easy. And guess what? She was invited. Alongside with a uh, party party, you know, there is saying that no party party for jungle at all. Now that they are both out on the streets, we will now see if they are still going to maintain that name or not. Now that she's back home, the husband is not saying anything. I'm very sure she even she herself, she will be expecting what her husband is going to say. She's expecting her husband's verdict as she does because. Uh, actually, if not for the fact that uh, she she did what she, uh, what she uh, what was unexpected, I'm very sure she will still be in the house. But that has really set a lot of signals hmm, to viewers out there. Even the Iowa youth are still calling for the ban of BB Nigeria as of now, saying the program is not okay. Yes, but also oh, you know, oh, well, that BB Nigeria was rated PG 18. Which means if you are under 18, you are not prepared to want to be like that. We all know that. But now, the Yarewa you are still saying, Bibi Nigeria should be banned because of all those explicit things being done on the, on the hair. You know, and <laughs> that got to her own nothing. She didn't even know she was being uh, caught on camera. Let her know she knew she was going to be caught on camera. I'm very sure she wouldn't have done such, uh, such a thing. And uh, you as a married woman, I just imagine how she was going to face her husband now that she's back home. I, I want to imagine, um, you know, how they are going to be relating. Is the marriage still going? Uh, the marriage is it going? To, uh, is it going to be the same as it used to be? Though the marriage has been having issues, it has been having lapses because the husband cheated in their matrimony. Oh, and now that the husband has, you know, come to ask for the forgiveness of sin. Hmm, whether you are you offend man or no. women, or when a man offend you, now woman see the chopper. Yes, so, because even the Bible made it known that women, eh, we are the of the house, we are home builders. So the foolish scatter our own home and destroy it with the foolishness, while the wise builds our own. So I want, to, I want to know the kind of category that is going to fall into now. Is it to the foolish one or the wise one? Because now I also imagine how she's going to face the society. How she's going to face her husband. How she's going to face her husband's family. I just want to imagine. Now, I still don't know. Maybe <laughs> the divorce is going to be done properly or it's still going to be paid because now it is 2 plus 2 equal to 1. You understand what I mean? The husband has cheated. She was also cheated. Yes. Because she wants to be fine. She might not actually... Mm. She can't even tell me that she herself, uh, herself and, uh, and Boma didn't make out. 
She can't tell me that because even why she was still being evicted, she was still telling Boma she was going to meet her. Boma was reciprocating the love. Can you just imagine that? Hey, hey, waiting her no go see for this baby and that stuff. No wonder, you know, don't I I just I give it I give it to the person who starts down still kill baby Niger season six um should be episode of shine your high but it's a pity uh Tega failed to shine her high just forgotten that it's a game of truth and death she was dead and she fought a victim and now she's a victim back to her mother's I just want to imagine what comes out of her marriage hmm. I pray I just pray her marriage does not break because of all this duvet issue or duvet saga. Yes. But all the same, I will still be bringing to you update as regards Boma, uh, as regards Tega, brother, and her husband. Tega is the bone of contention eh? So don't let's mistake it for. But you know, Tega and Boma were involved in some illicit acts which really stirred up the uh, anger of those watching baby Niger and you know how she's going to cope with a matrimonial despite the fact that her husband has apologized for being a cheat in the marriage. So sit and relax to your back as I bring to you another update. See you in our next video. Don't forget to always like, comment and share. Till then I still remain your host, Jumoke Abiodun, your Melanie. Okay.